Hi, uh, Jim here, and uh, showing um, my old Zimgar. Now this is one of those nifty, uh, you know, Tysco type guitars made somewhere in the 60s. Um, the thing about these Japanese guitars, and I've owned a lot of them over the years, is that you really have to play them, and some of them are players, and some of them are lookers. This is not such a looker, you know, it's a little guitar. Um, not really a short scale, I don't think. Uh, maybe 24 inch, something like that, because if you notice, the bridge is all the way back here. Um, but um, it's just not that crazy, not, doesn't have a lot of knobs and switches. But you know what? It's real basic and it sounds great. Not just for slide, but I'm playing it for slide today, with slide today because I have a broken finger. <laughs> so I've been doing a lot of two fingered guitar and bottleneck practicing lately. Um, this, the, the, the magic about this guitar really is the fact that it's one of the, it has one, if you notice the neck is just like, you know, it's just like an SG or not a Les Paul, but like an SG sort of, or a, a, a Gibson Melody Maker, which I think is what's basically probably a knockoff of. But it does have this plate, but it's really a set neck, and it, the Japanese folks back in the 60s just put a plate on there, because I guess they wanted to make it look more secure. <laughs> um, but it really is a set neck guitar. So it tends to uh, have a real nice sustain and um, just tone overall. In particular, uh, clean, which is why guys like Ry Cooter and people like that, David Lindley, like these old guitars. Not so much for their distorted tone, though they can sound trashy when you want them to, but really because they have a very glassy acoustic tone when you play them clean. On this one is nice. Does not have a you know any kind of an intonatable uh, bridge, but it does uh, play pretty well up and down the neck. Pickups that each have their own individual tone. This is the uh, neck. position with both pickups.
positions as well. So this is a Zimgar, but you'll also see this exact same guitar with uh, Tysco badging and probably other names as well. Um, 